hey guys welcome to another video tutorial here is a G and you are learning php and in this tutorial we're gonna learn how to send a bulk sms using clicktail so this is an api provider and using this we can send a, uh, messages to a single recipient and uh, uh, to a multiple recipient so before to write a code let me show you a quick demo and then we will write a code so here is a google service message.google.com your text message uh, will come here from your message uh, from your mobile to on your web so my messages will come here so when i type my number 9188272137891389 this is my indian number and you can use you can add if you have any another country's number so you can add like this if you have multiple numbers you can add like this but i have only one number so I I will test with one numbers because I don't want to waste a uh, uh, API uh, credits. So here is a message test messages messages with uh, link. So let me add a link, any link, and uh, using Indian number. Right. So I have added one number and a simple text message so when i click here to send we are expecting the text uh, here because this is the google service we can get the text message from our mobile to a, on a web so let's click on a send so message send successfully and we are expecting here so you can see i got the message this is a notification so let's click on here and you can see text message with the link and something the link and using indian number right so it's pretty easy to send a bulk sms and all the things i will show you step by step i will not escape any steps and uh, source code also available on my site so you can go through the link and you can get the source code so first thing uh, first uh, is you have to create a project like uh, this i have a click tail and you can give any name and then you have to create a composer.json file so let me show you here this is a composer.json file and you have to uh, add this package sdk of a click tail and once you add it uh, this code on your composer.json file which is this one you have to open here cmd and composer update any and yeah composer update up date any enter yeah you can see it's a uh, downloading uh, packages so let me delete this vendor dot uh, vendor folder and uh, let's execute again you can see it's downloading clicktail packages from us so just only one package it has uh, clicktail and it's downloading and it's installing so this command will automatically generate this vendor folder in your project next is you have to create the index.php file so this is a, a nb project this is not necessary folder because i'm using a netbean so that's why uh, it's automatically created for me so i don't want that uh, folder because there is a project uh, <clears throat> uh, details there and it will automatically create it nb project so i've deleted because that's uh, we don't need that so vendor automatically created composer.json we have a seed and uh, this is a style.css file so style.css is not important here so let me show you a very important file which is index.php so let's click uh, let's uh, drag and drop in our code editor so let me zoom in and zoom out so you can see clearly so first thing we have added autoload.php file which is this one vendors and here is autoload.php file and these two classes we have added this is the rest apis of a clicktail and here is a, a clicktail exception so these two classes uh, we need to include 
then simply uh, html doc html head tag this is normal html and i'm using a font which is a roboto this is not important part of this project but just uh, for the styling i will edit uh, those phones because i like that uh, this font which is a roboto and this is a h1 tag h2 tag send bulk sms using click tail and you can see send bulk sms and this is a response so just for that let me show you first just a form here is a form and here is a two uh, three fields uh, two fields uh, two text area first text area and second text area which is this one first and second and last is the send button which is this send button and here is a, a small uh, css i have added let's remove so you can see clearly this is send button uh, let me zoom in i don't know you are able to see or not but just remember uh, a small few things this is text area and its id is message and its id is number but the id is not important because we are using php so name is important name is message and its name is number so these two things is very important and it's action form action action is nothing here because uh, we are uh, doing uh, all the actions from the same file so you can uh, make it blank here let me zoom in yeah it's blank and last is the submit button and here i am using a jquery you can see here is a jquery but jquery is also not needed here and uh, let's let's understand php code when we have a message and when we have a number like uh, any message and when we have a number any number if doesn't have a number it shows a please message please type message and at least one number right so now we don't have any number and any message so it shows message please type message at least one number and message and if you have a numbers so we can uh uh, call the uh, call the method which is send message of the click tail so this is click tail send message to and this is a number of the array you can add many numbers separated by comma right like this let me show you this is number nine one or oh, just just minute let me copy and paste it here and the plus sign plus sign plus sign plus sign plus sign and comma 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 and comma you can add the numbers like these right so when we test and any message it will work so here is a content and content is simply a message whatever you will type so this message this message will comes here the next is for each loop it will extract the numbers from the list and will show the message here so this is message and message sent successfully and this is a message and message is a simply this one let me show you this is message and you can write uh, two mm, yeah dollar two to two and this two should be here so two is two number so it will show something like message sent successfully and this messages like uh, let's send yeah so all the messages send to this number this number this number this number this number and all the messages as goes goes right so it's work fine and here is a click tail exception so if there is any problem it will show a message uh, and some other few yeah it will show um, error message you can't send a message because there is a problem in your api right so this way you can send and here is a api key i don't uh, show you that one so you can see this is a api key of a click tail and uh, here is a click tail api developer and something you can read the documentation here so this is a click tail this is object and uh, this is a rest class and inside rest class is a click tail 
so click tail is an object and here i am adding uh, api key of click tail if you don't have an account you can cl uh, create click tail you can create uh, i think there is a double l mm, this is not click tail is double l click tail yeah this one so you can get an account from here and you will get uh, the keys right so pretty much we have a done and let me show you one more thing which is a uh, style.css so here is a style.css so you can see it's a simple style css height fit color and something button size and a common body and anything it's just simple uh, things mm -hmm. i have added here right so uh, guys uh, pretty much we have a done if you i think one more message i got <laughs> yeah this one yeah this one and uh, let me uh, test with the us number text now uh, i think that should work but i don't know i have a free apis so this is text now us number let's copy and edit here and a plus one and add a second number two seven two one three seven eight nine and the same message i am adding for saving a time um, here and uh, send let's comma and send now so message sent successfully so let's check here I think we are expecting first we have to press text now yeah guys you can see we got the number here two messages here and here and text now I think it's not showing a message because I have a free API keys so that's why I I'm not able to get the message from here so pretty much we have it done and if you have any questions and doubts you can write a comment i am here to help you and source code are available on our site so you can go through the link and you can get the source code so thank you for thanks for watching bye bye have a nice day bye bye